I had to toss a coin. But before I get into that, what's up, people? It's your boy Beast Game Akuma here with my thoughts on the new Marvel game that got announced today, Marvel Rivals. Now, honestly, I was debating on doing a video reaction on it and sharing my thoughts or play some demos. But you know, I did a coin toss in this one, so we're gonna get into this. We're gonna talk about it afterwards. I'm not gonna spoil anything for those that haven't seen it yet. But let's check it out. Net Ease Games. You'll need a top-notch team to win this one. Okay. Ooh. See some familiars. Okay, you got Doc Strange, Panther, and all that robot. That Penny Parker might be Penny Parker. Looks amazing. Okay, I get it. I get it. Okay, it's a Overwatch clone. I get it. Team ups activated. I don't know how Hulk and Iron Man does a team. That's like the other person. That's Iron Man. Okay, 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 okay. Maximum Spider. Who is she? Okay. Team up activated. Who is he? I say okay, that's Loki. I guess they're gonna have some original. Oh, look at Black Panther. Damn. That man, he. Looks like they're gonna have destructive new areas. Oh, that'd be cool. Hit, okay, and group. Of course, they got a team up attack, of course. Oh, destructible boards. I like this. Damn. Who are you? Oh, that's Penny Parker. Hulk, of course. Damn. Of course. That's strange. Luna Snow. He's original. Wait. I like that Spider-Man, of course. You know Galactus? Interesting. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, Mantis. I see... Is that Punisher? Mm. This is where we have our little chat about what we just saw. Marvel Rivals. Unexpectedly a MOBA, or Overwatch clone, as most people are saying at this point in time. I'm not gonna lie, at first I was spe uh, skeptical about it because I mean, eh. but looking at it from a different point of view, I can see the appeal that it's gonna have and how awesome that's gonna be, especially with all the different Marvel character powers. And I know it's probably gonna be a free to play game, so definitely expect some either, ga uh, either a season pass, like you know, battle pass. Hopefully, it's a battle pass and not a loot crate system because we're supposed to be done with loot crate systems. I definitely want to see the new characters, though, because, first of all, Luna Snow, I gotta look who up she is. She might be an original character for the game, because sometimes when Marvel does, you know, certain video games, they make an original character, just like they did in Midnight Suns, but, um, and then the Namor-type character, I want to know who that was. Was it Namor, and it just redesigned, or is Namor's son? So we're gonna find out. Now, we saw some extra characters, like, we saw Wanda, of course, Scarlet Witch, we saw Mantis, we saw Storm, we saw... Uh, Star Lord. I can't remember who the gentleman was in the background. It looked like Punisher. It could be Punisher, but the characters are endless. And it, it's like they got so much room to add certain characters. But so far, we saw in the battle is Hulk, Iron Man, Groot, Rocket Raccoon, Luna Snow, Magic, uh, Loki, the Aquaman, the Namor looking character. I'm going to say Aquaman. Well, he has a freaking trident, so I'm like, uh, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Spider-Man, of course, Black Panther, all oh, looks good. And now I want to know about the destructible areas. That's actually quite interesting that they're adding. But I'm also intrigued because this makes it a unique experience. Not just, just because it has Marvel characters, but it also has team attacks, which is pretty cool. And you have to coordinate with certain people. Now, I didn't see Wolverine. Wolverine better be in this game. And they should add Colossus because fastball special as a team attack must be a thing. And he could take out a whole slew of people with a fastball attack. That's just me personally. That's just my own personal thought process. But then you have other ideas like, you know, Captain America. And of course, a team up attack with Iron Man with the use of the shield and the beam attack. We've seen it many times before. We saw it in Ultimate Marvel Alliance and we saw it in the movies. So, like I said, possibilities are endless. 
And I do agree with some of my friends. We need the the more savage characters like Sabretooth, Venom. Oh my god, damn. Could you imagine they actually put Sabretooth in this game? It might not because, you know, Wolverine, you don't want to have two feral characters in it. But adding more feral characters actually be dope. You gotta, like I said, you gotta hold Marvel Universe to use. Especially characters that you can put in the limelight. Especially after X-Men 97. New Mutants. I wouldn't put... Now, there are some... I mean, they already added Storm, and she's an Omega-level mutant. But you gotta add Iceman. You gotta add Gambit. Oh, you definitely gotta add Punisher, Daredevil, Elektra. I mean, this might be seasons down the line, so we, we'll see what happens. Jubilee. Yes, I said Jubilee. Shadow Cat. How is she working the game? I mean, she can phase through things, and she also has combat skills, so that could definitely work. Especially with her little dragon, too, so... The possibilities of many... Oh, I mean, you gotta add Deadpool. Come on. Deadpool has to be in this game. They might have to censor him a bit, but... It be Deadpool. Deadpool has to be in it. Come on now. Come on, Deadpool. Let's, let's just make that happen. <laughs> I don't know. It was a, it's a fun looking... It looks fun, and I'm, I'm definitely gonna check it out. So, they say in a cold...